A Texas man has been arrested and charged in connection with that so-called knockout game. Let's take a quick look at the attack that happened. This is what usually goes down. It's a sucker punch um, to a complete stranger, and they take off. Poppy Harlow is with us now from New York. Poppy, tell us what we're talking about here. What, what's the update? We've been following this, obviously, for a while. Sure, and our viewers have heard a lot about it. It's very disturbing. The video you just showed is part of one alleged knockout game, not the instance we're talking about it, but it gives people an idea of, of what's happening. Well, federal officials have arrested a 27-year-old from Katy, Texas, and charged him with a federal hate crime. We have a picture we can show you. His name is Conrad Alvin Barrett. They say that in late November, he approached a 79-year-old African-American man, hit him so hard in the jaw that he he fell to the ground and then allegedly Barrett laughed as he said, quote, knockout, got into his vehicle and fled. This is all according to the criminal complaint that was just unsealed. The law enforcement officials are saying that the victim, the 79-year-old man, suffered two jaw fractures, was hospitalized for several days, had to get metal plates inserted. So you can see how serious this is. Uh, again, this is being charged as a federal hate crime, showing the severity of it. In the complaint, I won't even read you some of the language, but federal officials say they saw other videos on the cell phone of Barrett that used the N-word, had some racial, uh, very, very racist things that were said. So that is why this crime uh, is, is being, um, being charged as a hate crime. Uh, one of our affiliates in Houston had a chance to talk to a family member, someone named Joseph Lewis, who is the nephew of the alleged victim. I want you to listen to what he said. His face was swollen on this side. He said he had three plates in there. You know, he's sucking out a, a straw. What the world coming to? And I also want to read you, Kira, something from the complaint. This comes from, from the federal complaint. It says, in another video, Barrett is driving around. It goes on to say, and he states that he is trying to work up the, quote, courage to play, quote, the knockout game. So what is Barrett saying about this? I had a chance to speak for a long time on the phone this morning with his attorney because Barrett is in jail right now. His attorney said that his client, Barrett, has been charged with, uh, has been rather diagnosed with bipolar disorder. He said that his client is on medication. He also said that at this point, he cannot say whether or not his client did or was involved at all in this attack. But he said this, quote, he said, mental health issues definitely played a part in anything that occurred. He also went on to say he, his client, is very sorry for this person.